Hi y'all, this is Brainy with Brainy's Creations and I'm here with um, another video. Um, it's just a little update and also a haul video. Um, so as you can see, I kind of started with new lighting and a new area. And um, so I just actually, I've been waiting to go and buy a tripod. So I went out and I got one. And um, so I went to Walmart today and I'm going to, let me zoom out. Um... I don't know how easy I'm going to be able to show out here. It's Targus, I guess. Targus, something like that. It's a 42-inch universal travel tripod. So, it's a travel tripod. So, I might also... I'm going to Europe um, this summer for 22 days. So, I might actually bring this along with me. Because I am bringing my camera. So, I might want to bring this along as well. So this was only $16, so I thought it was pretty good for a universal tripod. It's pretty good. I kind of caught myself on it, and yeah, I already cut myself on it. Because um, it like locks, and like the metal caught my skin, and yeah, that hurt a lot. Um, so um, I've been working on a lot of projects. Actually, if I turn around real quick without, I'm going to cover you guys up just so I don't make you sick. Um... I'm working on that project right now. I'm not the happiest with it. Um, it's drying, you know, like with E6000. And it's a cake box. Now, stacking cake box. Now, um, using Graphic 45, um, I covered the inside of the boxes so they would open. But I didn't like how the boxes looked just on top of each other. So, I made some, put some fancy posts and such and glued them on. Hopefully this will be stable, and I'm going to try my best to make it as stable as I can. So the boxes can still open, it's just going to be really, really difficult. So probably I'm going to sell it as just a decoration piece. So you can see I have all my stuff. Um, I actually did a huge saw crafters haul as well. You can see here I have a hot glue gun thing I cut. I have a couple of things in those bins over there, and I'll show you what I did. Um, oops, alright, over here, this is a, a makeup case, now if I open it, these are all my new, newer, whoops, so, sorry, I'm getting used to this tripod, guys, um, sock rafter stuff, so that's, the, whoop, excuse me, that's where all that stuff is. And yeah. Alright, let me cover this up. Um Alright. I have a I have to clean out my craft I have to clean up my craft room a little bit. It's kinda of a little getting uh cluttered again. It's kinda of getting cluttered again. Just a little bit. Um so I'm gonna have to work on that at some point. Not today, because it's really late, but I'm going to try and work on this project tomorrow as well. Um, so, yeah. Um, my business update, um, I'm actually going to, let me pick this up one more time. I had a couple of things made for my business. I had new car door magnets made, because my old ones are terrible. And it's going to be a little dark, but I had... A lawn sign made with my logo. I'm gonna cover you guys up again. And let me show you what else I had done. I'm just, I'm, like I said, I'm getting used to this, so bear with me, guys. Um, well, if I can find my cell phone, here it is. So. I have my business case now, my logo on my phone case, and I also keep, whoops, I keep one of my, my favorite artwork pieces, which is my painter's palette, which um, was bought off of me from another artist. I keep as my background for all my stuff, so I have it on my phone, my iPad, my Mac, everything. Um, and then, well, besides the inside picture, that's me and my boyfriend see oh there's me there's him okay 
Um, so yeah, and actually, if I go, I'll show you my, real quick, um, my Britney's Creations. So if you guys want to like my page, I want to, I'm going to try out for um, Graphic 45 again. You can see here, I don't know if I did a video of this yet. Oh yeah, I did do a video of this, but that's my lighthouse. I did, there's my baby mini, so. So, there's my page. Okay. Um, I also had a bag made. So this is, um, this is the bag I'm going to use with me when I go to fairs to put all my business stuff in. Or if I'm going to a meeting, or if I'm just kind of going out and I want to carry a bunch of shit with me. Um, sometimes I'll bring it to the mall, not always but yeah it's a black and it's a black and white canvas bag and it has my my name on it my logo and my my business cell and my my work number so if you guys are interested in a custom order that's where you would call i also had t-shirts made for everyone who helps me um at my craft fairs so me my younger sister my mom as well as my boyfriend. So, I think this is my sister's. Is this my sister's? Or is this mine? Oh, well this is mine, but what it is, they're white t-shirts. And so the front has my logo. Which you can see, BC Inc. And then the back has my name, my business name. So, yeah, I had all those made as well, and I also had, well, I had to buy address labels, so I had address labels made, because I needed them, and I also had postcards done with my artwork, which I will show you, so here is, um, you know, there's my painter's palette, this is my other cake box I did, which I'm very proud of, um, yeah, I'm fine. My lighthouse. This is one of my mixed media tags I did. And this is actually one of my drawings. If you guys do not know, this is, um, I do charcoal drawings. This I actually entered into a youth, um, art show at, um, the NJ Pack Children's Art Museum or art show, whatever it was. And I won first place for this. Um, so it just says mixed media altered artist, Britney's creations. And then, um, I'm just going to cover my address. Brittany's Pochick, Brittany's Creations, just my business address. And then, you know, basic information. That's my website. And then my numbers as well. So, yep. I really like how they came out. Um, and I also had a couple pens made. You know, I gave one to everyone who's, like, in my business. And, um... So, yeah, really simple. The black and the white, again, with the, just the logo. So, really, really like that. So, there's my business update. Um, I, have a, I have a swap to share with you. I received my St. Patty's Day. Um, um, ooh. Sorry, this has been giving me trouble all day. Um, this is from Marcia Crawford. I don't know if I said that right. Um, Marcia Crawford, I think I said that, and it was a St. Patty's Day ATC swap, and these are the beautiful ATCs she made me. This one's fabric. This one's pretty cool. She sewed this one. That's really unique, and she sent me a little extra goodie, so thank you. Had a lot of fun with that. All right, on to the haul. I know this has nothing to do with scrapbooking, but I bought a new, um, um, real tree. I guess you can say jacket. It's like one of those zip down, and it's a Duck Dynasty one. I was in Walmart. Um, I have another one, but I like I love D Duck Dynasty, and um, I think I paid ten bucks for this because there was a hole in it, but I fixed it, and it looks really nice on me. So, yeah, and I hunt so. Just another one to my collection. There was like 
which side was it? I think it was this side. Yeah, you can't really tell by looking at it. Not really, see? But they like, when sewing it, they mi miss the fabric. So I just fixed it. So yeah, that I paid 10 bucks for. I love how it says redneck approved. I also bought my, my boyfriend's going plowing, so um, <clears throat> I bought him a pair of gloves because he doesn't know what he did with the other ones. Alright, so, and that was all at Walmart, so this is what I got from Walmart. Um, I got two packs of post-it notes because I got the Saw Crafters post-it note holders, and I want to do them f for the craft fair, which is next month, so I want to try and get as much stuff done this month and some parts of next month and then get everything together um you know i have a bunch of small projects i want to do so i'm going to finish up this cake box and then when i'm done with that i'm going to start some of the multiple smaller projects and once i get those done i'll go back to some of the other projects but um because this cake box has taken me so far like two or three days i think two days hopefully i'll have it done tomorrow and then I had another project, and I had, I had a flood down here, so I had to go buy new furniture and other stuff. So I was like, I was really hysterical, but it's okay. Nothing got ruined besides the furniture, but yeah. Anyway, got two packs of post-it notes. I hope that doesn't fall down. Um, I got a bunch of pearls because. I use pearls tucked in in my flowers on every single project, and I'm running out of my nice pearls I bought, um, I think from Lily. Um, so I got these, these are like $4, but there's 325 so these are just cheap plastic beads. But then I found these, I can get them. These were a dollar, so there's these like packs. So I got beaded chain because I do make jewelry, so that was a dollar. And then these packs of beads were also a dollar, so I got these red ones because I really like these two tone ones. And then I got four packs of these pearls, and they're I believe they're glass. So that goes to that. And then I also got, these were, I believe, 97 cents? I believe they were 97 cents. And these are glass beads. So I got the off-white. This is like a peach, like a pinky white. Like a pinky white. This is an ivory. So you can kind of see the difference. And then this is a white. So this is that pink, that very, very pale pink kind of white. This is ivory. And then this is white. So I got those. They didn't have these in the large, so I got those. And then I also got the blue, this like light teal. Because I've been, I kind of, this is like one of my favorite colors as well. So when it comes to shabby chic, there's my shabby chic colors I love. And I have real pearls, but these are just to tuck in like my flowers and stuff. You know, I'm not going to really put my real pearls unless it's for like a special project or if I'm doing like a wedding project or something like that. I also got another, you know, like bead container because I needed another one. So I picked that up. I'm gonna kind of pile this back there. That didn't work very well, did it? Oh, I think I got five of these. There's another one on the ground. So there's another one. Um, and then I got a couple. Of, I got like soda, and I bought my boyfriend a Red Bull. I don't know why he likes that, but. Um, and then I also got another E6000, which I just bought another one, like, before, which I've been using on the project I showed you before. And then I got Fabric Tech. This was the last.